come from where, where? They don't make your kind no more. No, no more You're more like an auntie What it is Desi Mom, it's your girl Desi Dance Back with another mother freaking video Before I even jump into it Make sure you like Why my voice sound like that? Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you subscribe today. Go ahead and join the Desi Mob because we the litest mob on my freaking YouTube. But you knew that though. Um, but we just gonna jump right into it today. Today I just got a little quick little story time. Um, this is gonna be a very quick story time because it actually happened like was it a week ago or two weeks ago? No, it was a week ago. Or two weeks ago. I think it was a week and a half ago. I think it was a week and a half ago. But um, yeah. So I'm just jump. I don't know why my voice keeps sounding like this. Like I'm gonna need to get it together, cause baby girl. Whew. All right. So today I got a story time, as y'all already seen. Um, and this is just a story time about the other day when I was in a high speed chase with the cops. Um, I shouldn't say cops. But I could say two cops. I'm gonna say I was in a high speed chase with 12. Cause that's really what it was. Uh, it was just one cop. Um, yeah. So, it was one night. Me and two of my friends that I've been friends with since like high school. Well, we had like stopped talking. But we back talking. You know how that junk go. So, yeah. I was with them. We was like, yo, you know, you know, Shan, let's just go out tonight. Let's go have a great night. Let's go out tonight. Whatever, whatever. We was going to my friend's. It was my friend's birthday. And, like, he has a whole birthday weekend every year. And this was the first day. So, it was just a smooth little kickback. But it was far from my house. Real far, y'all. It was, like, 45 minutes from my house. And if it's 45 minutes from my house, then that means it's far, okay? So, it was 45 minutes from my house. We all met at my house. And it was going to leave from my house and go. Y'all. So, we all getting lit before we, before we, um... Before we go out, you know, we at my house, we sipping a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Um, not a little bit, actually a lot, okay? I was I was a little too lit in the back seat. Um, and then my other friend, so Autumn had just met up with us, so she didn't drink like that like we did. And like, she was supposed to drink, like we brought the drinks in the car, okay? We brought the, we brought the bottles in the car. And she was supposed to drink on the way there, but she had to do her makeup first, and she didn't want to be lit while she had to do her makeup. So we like, bet, okay, cool. But my friend that was driving, she had been drinking a little bit. Okay. Never, never, never drink and drive. First of all, that's all I want to say. Never drink and drive. I do not drink and drive. Um, everybody know if I go to a function, I'm in drove. I'm going to be chilling. That's just that on that. Never drink and drive, and that's just that on that. But I don't know not one person that don't drink and drive. Everybody do it, and it's a problem, and we need to stop. But anyway, so my friend that was driving us that night, she had been drinking just a little bit. She was tipsy, okay? She wasn't, like, drunk like me, but she was tipsy, okay? So... We was stalling this whole time. We're like, bro, we gotta go. We was late. We was like, bro, let's go, let's go. So we're like, all right, bet. So we on the way there, mind you, we already leaving like an hour late. And the place is still 45 minutes away, okay? So we get in the car. My friend that's driving, y'all, she has a terrible driving record. She speeds, she didn't got two super speeders. She just be speeding all the time. You know, like, she's always driving fast. Like, my chair keeps squeaking and I don't like this. But she's just a super speeder. She be driving fast all the time. She just gonna do what she do and that's just that on that. But that's not a good combination. Drinking and speeding? What was she thinking, y'all? What was she thinking? Okay, but anyway, so we driving. We're going down 85. If you live in Atlanta, you know. We going from Buckhead. We in between Buckhead and downtown. Going 85. Shoo. All right. So, we going fast. We all the way in the fast lane. We just going 130. Okay? She got a challenger. We just going 130. We like, all right. You know, I love I love going fast. So, I'm in the back seat like, hey, go, 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 go. My friend that was in the passenger seat, seat, she like, you need to slow down. You need to slow down. Oh, my God. She was praying because she was nervous. So, I'm like, nah, we lit. Forget that. We gone. We gone at them boys. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Then, we fly past a car on the shoulder. I look at the car. I'm like, oh, shh. That's 12. 
So my friend, she like hesitated. Cause you know, you see 12, you gonna automatically break and slow down. But we already going 130. So you ain't finna slow down that much. Speed limit like 55, 65. You not finna slow down that much. It's just not finna happen. So I told her, I was like, bro, it's too late now. It's too late. <laughs> you gotta keep going. So I'm looking back, I'm in the back seat. So I'm looking back like this. And my friend in the front seat told my other friend to get off. So you know, well, if you don't know, because some of y'all don't live in Atlanta. But getting off 85, before you get downtown, you got to get off on, you You don't got to get off. It's 75 is right here. So 75 was our next exit that was closest to us. So we just hopped on another interstate. We jumped off that interstate, hopped on the other interstate. I look back in my rear view, 12 is on us, bruh. I'm like, oh my God, this nigga is flying to come catch us. I'm like, oh my God, bruh. No, it can't go down like this. My friend, she was under... She was under 21 and she had been drinking and she already had two super speeders and we had open alcohol in the car so we was just going down y'all I was like oh my god oh my god okay but anyway so then after that we hop off on 75 we hop off our exit to go to the next exit I'm like y'all 12 is on us bro so once we get on 75 He's still coming. He's still coming. He has not let up. And we still going. We still going 130. We not slowing down. If We probably was going 150 at that time. Because we going. You know what I'm saying? So then after that, I'm like, yo, take this first exit because he's still on us. Take this first exit. He's still on us. So we shoom. Get off the first exit. Why is 12 still behind us, bro? We cannot lose this nigga. I'm like, bro, oh my God. So then when we get off the exit, we take that first right. Boom. Take the right. 12 was like, I'm looking, because I'm looking in the back the whole time to see where 12 at. 12 had, when we turned like this, 12 had kept straight, so I seen him like go right there. When he seen our car going down here, like, it's like he noticed it late. He stopped so freaking hard and reversed and came back down the street, bro. I'm like, oh my God, bro. Is this really, I'm really going to have to call my mama and tell her like... I'm getting locked up tonight. Like, am I really about to sit here and have to make that call? Lord, please. Lord, I was praying. I was praying. We all pray. So we all was praying. We like, God, please, God. God, just get us out this one situation, God. We won't never do it again, God. Okay, so then after that, y'all, we was, we was going down. We was making every turn. We was on back roads where there's houses and stuff at. And if you know where houses and stuff at, it's a lot of speed bumps. And the speed bumps be big. So we not we not breaking though. We go over the speed bumps. We in the air like this and coming back down. In the air like this and coming back down on every speed bump, bro. So after a while, I'm like, I don't see 12, I don't see 12. So we was like, bet we don't see him right now. So we tell my friend to pull up in somebody's driveway, bro. We tell her pull up in somebody's driveway. But you know how like well, y'all might not know, but when you in a house, when you running from 12, you can't pull all the way up in the people's driveway because you don't know them like that. You just got to pull in, you know, and sit at the bottom. No. My friend pulled all the way up to their garage. I'm like, this bitch. Oh, my God. She pulled all the way up to their garage. What if the people would have called the police on us? We would have been caught. Like, they would be like, oh, yeah, we were just chasing them. Da, da, da. So, then after that, after she pulled up, we like, bro, cut your lights off. So she cut the car off. The lights will not go off, bro. I'm like, oh my God. So at this point, I'm like, bump this. We getting caught. Mama, I called my mama. I was like, mom, I got to tell you something. <laughs> I was like, we in a high speed chase. <laughs> she like, what? Oh my God. Oh my God. Because my mom be panicking, y'all. So my mom like, what? Oh my God. Oh my God. Why would y'all do that? Da, da, da. I'm like, mom. We going down, like my friend, she under 21, she been drinking, she drinking and driving. We got open liquor in the car. I threw it in the trunk when we was when we was uh, in the chase, but I was like, they might go through the trunk. They got they when you run from the car, they automatically gonna think you in the wrong, which we was. So I was just like, we going down today. So then after that, I was like, bro, hit the lock button on your keys. So she hit the lock button on her keys, and the keys and the lights turned off. So I'm like, all right, bet. We sat there for maybe about. How long we sat there? I think we sat down about 15 minutes. Mind you, we and somebody we don't know driveway, bruh. And sitting there for about 15 minutes, bruh. And we're all the way pulled up at the top. I'm like, bruh, dang, bruh. Something happened. So, 
I'm like, y'all, let's sit here for, mind y'all, I already said we was late for the party and now we doing all this. We already like 15 extra minutes out of the way and we wasting all this time running from the cops. So I'm like, all right, bro, it better be the best party of my life. So I'm like, all right, bro, we sitting there, it's been 15 minutes, we like, all right, bro, let's go. Let's go back out on the street, but y'all, Y'all don't understand. I was praying, Lord, please don't let nobody be waiting on us when we get up there. Don't let nothing, bro. I was just like, Lord, please. Because you never know. The police could have called back up. They could have been waiting on us. They could have known that it was only one street we could come out to. You know, we didn't know that area. We was just out. So I'm like, Lord, please, Lord. Lord, please, bro. So we coming out, and the police was gone. We got away from the cops. Then. We got to the party, and me and one of my friends was having a good time, but the one who drove and got, and we didn't did all this to get out, to run from the cops and all this, she wasn't even having fun. So we just left. And then later that night, they be having like car meetups and stuff in Atlanta. We went to one of those, cause I told y'all she got a challenger. And the police would just kept following us and stuff. I was just like, Ugh. This has been a long, eventful night, and I think it's time for us to go home. We kept running from the cops because they kept coming at the car shows. Oh, it was just too much. But yeah, that happened like a week and a half ago. Yeah. So, that's all for this story time. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. But before I close this video out, I do have to give my post notification shout out winner. And your, my post notification shout out winner goes to. Can I get a drum roll? Please. Okay, my post notification shout out winner goes to Tay So Sexy. Let me tell y'all something. Shout out to you, Tay So Sexy. Thank you for following me on Instagram, TikTok, and subscribing to my YouTube channel. I love you. Thank you for your love. But let me tell y'all something. Y'all be over here coming done, and I be going looking for it, and I don't be seeing it. So now when you come in done, you got to add your um your Instagram name so I can go look for it. Add your at name so I can go look for it when I'm picking who going to win. If you don't have your at name, you can't win. But um that's all for this motherfucking video, motherfucking video. Um to act to enter to win the next post notification shout out drawing, all you got to do is follow me on Instagram right here. Follow me on TikTok right here. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and make sure you turn that post notification bell. Also, you'll be notified every time your girl posts. Um, yeah. I really hate wearing my hair in a ponytail and doing a video because I look so freaking bald head and I already got a round head. But that's all for this video. I love y'all and I'll be back tomorrow.